depending on uh, what uh, is actually missing or is uh, damaged in the maxilla or midface, uh, surgeries could include transplanting uh, bone from your leg or your hip um, and sometimes your back uh, to rebuild the main bony structures that are underneath your eye and between your jawbone. The surgical procedure can vary uh, depending on uh, the extent of the uh, trauma or uh, loss of tissue in the maxilla. Uh, examples of uh, surgeries that we could perform include transplanting tissue such as your own bone from your leg, hip, or shoulder uh, to rebuild the bony structure of the face. Um, other examples of surgeries that can be performed is uh, 3D printed implants uh, that can achieve symmetry uh, from both the left and the right side. Depending on the type of surgery performed, uh, the recovery period it depends uh, on the extent of the uh, original uh, defect or trauma to the face. Uh, things such as an implant uh, could be two to three week recovery while Transplanting bone from the leg can sometimes be more uh, longer, such as six to eight weeks. It depends uh, on the extent of the uh, defect involved, um, whether it's from trauma or cancer, and how much bone or, or skin and uh, soft tissue is missing from the face. Uh, sometimes it can be one surgery, sometimes in more complicated uh, uh, deformities of the face, we have to perform multiple surgeries to achieve the outcome uh, that most patients would want. Our team here of facial plastic surgeons work with a multidisciplinary group of uh, practitioners, uh, including speech therapists, uh, prosthetics, uh, oral maxillofacial surgery, as well as facial plastic surgery to uh, work as a group to, to achieve the outcomes of some of these complex reconstructive surgeries. We have extensive experience with dealing with deformities and um, uh, issues of the maxilla and the midface, um, particularly from trauma, uh, cancer, and congenital uh, reasons.